Hey Paul, what's that plant? Well that plant, Scott, is the peanut butter cassia, or you also could call it the popcorn cassia. But anyways, it's in the pea family and it's a cassia, and it's a shrub, it's an annual um, in colder climates, but here in San Diego County, uh, in Southern California, I guess you could say, it is an evergreen. Uh, it will be semi-deciduous, it's, it's tolerant to like 20 degrees, but the reason why it has a funny name, or the peanut butter cassia, or popcorn cassia, is it has really, really fragrant leaves. When you pull them off and smell, it smells kind of, to me it smells more spicy or hot or kind of peanut buttery. But um, it's a very unique plant, super easy to grow. Um, if you see one in your neighborhood, you could just pull off these seeds, pop them open, and literally throw them in the soil, and they'll just grow. So this is a really easy plant. It is invasive, um, so that if the seeds, you know, a couple years ago, we had some good rains, and the uh, seeds were dispersed down to the creek way down there, and uh, plants grew until it actually rained the next year, and they got too much water and died. But as you can see, there are these seeds, super easy to grow. You could buy them online for nothing. Um, I've probably grown 15 or 20 plants from these seeds. And usually I just cut them before they drop so they don't uh, spread to our uh, environment here. So, um, it's native to Africa, what else? It, it's a really fast grower. It'll grow six to eight feet in a year. Um, I usually prune it back about this time before the seeds, like I said, spread out and disperse. Um, and it's in the middle of uh, early January into December and you can see it's, it blooms beautifully. Um, you can see the structure of the flowers. It's typical yellow and a typical cassia. However, this is kind of a bit unique. Um, and it's, it's a super fragrant plant, super easy to grow. Um, like I said, you could grow probably something this this tall. It's about five or six feet, maybe seven feet, um, in one to two years. This plant here is about four years old and I cut it back um, uh, around now. Or I'm going to trim it back pretty soon after all the flowers go. Uh, easy to find in most nurseries or you could look, look online and buy a bunch of seeds for nothing. Um, or like I said, if you see one in, in your neighborhood and want to grab a few seeds, it's as easy as that, and now you could have a uh, peanut butter cassia. So, um, we have some more cassias coming your way in the future episodes, so hopefully you'll give us a subscribe and tune in. All right, bam. It's a super fragrant plant.